Tomorrow, Governor Chris Sununu will sign an executive order to require all New Hampshire K-12 schools to offer an in-person learning option at least two days a week. The data is all very clear, whether it's the CDC, the state, everyone has said that there's no reason that these uh, schools cannot open even without a vaccination. Schools must operate with at least a hybrid learning model starting March 8th. Sununu says 60% of schools are already doing that, with about 40% currently learning in person five days a week. But the governor's order won't affect many districts. His office says less than 20 schools statewide are fully remote right now. It isn't just so the kids come back and have a more fuller, robust learning model. It really is for the behavioral and mental health, the isolation issues that so many of our students um, have been bearing with. Sununu says other states have already gone this route and that this is about managing the virus for the long term. We've allowed a lot of flexibility for our districts to gear up, time for them to gear up, the, the money, the resources, it's all there. Teachers are still in group 2A for vaccinations, meaning they're on track to get their shots in April. We could do it by school district. We could set up our own uh, internal sites by district. We could, you know, direct them directly to our already open sites across the state. Sununu says his team is confident in the data that there continues to be low transmission rates in the classrooms and that the virus can be managed with the right precautions in place. Reporting live in Concord tonight, Mike Cronin, WMUR News 9.